in your health tonight. Sinus surgery with some high-tech navigation. It's similar to a GPS, and until recently, it was only offered in hospitals. News 8's medical reporter Jocelyn Mementa was there when a doctor was the first in the state to do an in-office procedure. So you watched this unfold, Jocelyn? I did. Ann and Darren, <laughs> you are also in just a few seconds. Okay. The technology was so large it could only be used in a hospital setting. Now it's down to a small computer and benefiting patients like Eric Fleisch. I do want to warn all of you, we are taking you into surgery and it may be too graphic for some of you. Just like when it first went in, you felt it a little bit. And then Eric Fleisch is under local yeah. anesthesia, um, awake for this in-office sinus procedure at Connecticut ENT Sinus and Allergy in Norwalk. Dr. Robert Weiss is his surgeon. We're doing a, sort of a combination procedure of balloon sinus dilation of the sinuses, but we're also doing some polyp and some tissue removal as well. His patient deals with sinus infections all year round. My sinuses fill up, they don't drain, it gets infected. Eric wants a permanent solution. Well, sleeping, uh, the pain of a sinus infection, uh, the drainage, um, you can't constantly take antibiotics and decongestant tablets. To get the job done, Dr. Weiss relies on a navigation technology that is now compact enough it can be used in an office setting. Fiagon is sort of the latest in the development of this technology. The system allows him to operate and see exactly where he is in real time using Eric's CT scan. It's like a little dot on a map. So we're, we're using the CAT scan as a map. The little dot with the little crosshairs is showing us exactly where we are. So that polyps. He's got a little uh, polyp right here that we're gonna be removing. Causing the blockage of Eric's sinuses can be easily removed, all done in his office. That is the culprit, yes. So wherever you see that sort of white fleshy versus this nice pink tissue, uh, that's, the, that's the abnormal disease that's, that literally blocks the sinuses. The biggest benefit? This would be impossible without high definition um, imaging and scopes. Fine-tuning patient safety for routine in-office practices. We can do things um, in a very safe manner because we know exactly where we're working. We know exactly where our instrument is at all times. For patients like Eric. It's not uncomfortable? It's not uncomfortable, that's correct. Oh, yeah. A shorter procedure time. Yes, that was Eric saying it was not uncomfortable. The procedure takes about 30 minutes and patients are usually able to get back to normal activity later in the day. For more information, head to our website, WTNH.com.